Good morning. This is this is day two. This is morning two of Stitch Up Brooklyn, and I've already lost my voice. Apparently, my voice is going, and I need it for today, so that's the problem. But uh, we're here. We're starting out with the Indie Dyed Yarn Breakfast. So several Indie Dyed Yarn Dyers, several Indie Dyers of yarn from around our area are gathering this morning to share their beautiful creations with all of us the stitchers. We're going to eat breakfast and we're also going to taste the yarn. We're also gonna taste the yarn, which is stupendous. I'm standing right next to this beautiful, I think it's an in-progress mural here in Greenpoint, Brooklyn. And next to it, we have installed our yarn bump. Now, I think it's going to become more than this but for now, this is what we were able to accomplish from last night, 5.30, to I think I heard two in the morning last night. So here is a sneak peek of it in progress. It's so beautiful. We did that, we stitchers did that. So more to come, and it's right next to this gorgeous mural. I'm loving it. Thank you, Red Heart, for all of this gorgeous yarn. Where's yours? Right here. Wow. <laughs> It's so cool because everyone can find their piece, right? Yeah, exactly. I was like, oh, I see mine. Mine's near yours, yeah. Yeah. I, I discovered yours this morning. You did? Yeah. Where's yours? See, look. Here I am about to go to the lobby of the Box House Hotel where I'm meeting all of the stitchers for Worldwide Stitch in Public Day. I had to dress as the Dominator because I'm riding a ferry. So whenever a bunch of stitchers are on public transportation, Dominator has to come. So let's go meet the stitchers. Look at Cassie. You poor girl. I want to see them. Show me. What is the What is the plan? Are we walking and stitching? Who's walking and stitching? Yes. 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 Okay. Look. Here's the Dominators. Boots. Those boots are fierce. Can I see that? These boots are made for knitting in public day. Stitching. Stitching in public day. Here are the stitchers. They're behind me. I kind of like my wig today. It's 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 kind of acting like a little humid. We have to wait for the cars. This is not a crosswalk. <laughs> and I am not, I don't have insurance, so knitters, be careful. Okay, careful, this is not a crosswalk. Look at, there's the beautiful Manhattan skyline in the distance. It's so bright. Look at all the stitchers, we're gonna get on the ferry. Oh my gosh, I need to get my sunglasses. It's all right, it's okay, it's okay. Okay, here we go. There are tons of stitchers up top of this ferry, but I was, I was recording everyone getting on the ferry, so I didn't make it up top. But I'm down below, and we're getting our stitching on. We are stitching in public on the East River Ferry. It is so epic. Sad faces. We didn't get to go up top. All right, we can still stitch in public.
muscles right now. Yeah. They want to know what's going on, and we're telling them. We are schooling them in the art of stitching, knitting, crocheting in public. We have a very busy day ahead of us. All the knitters are piling off this ferry. We're heading to Brooklyn Bridge Park now. Amanda, are you telling me that our ferry was pink? It was. Dominator pink. Our ferry was Dominator pink. Are you kidding me? We have found the Brooklyn Bridge. There it is! We have found Jane's carousel. There it is! Some people might choose to ride it if they don't get sick going round and round and knitting. But we're gonna take a pic really quick and then everyone can do whatever they want on in this park, Stitch in Public Day. Love it. You gotta find a little spot to sit and knit. I know. That's what I wanna I do. I wanna sit. Well, I might cross the Brooklyn Bridge. I might go. Hey! Dominator here. It's too bright. We are about to get to the entrance of the Brooklyn Bridge and some very brave stitchers have followed me. So we're gonna we're gonna make this happen right now. Wish us luck. Hey Dominate. Is anyone stitching and doing the stairs? I wanna know. I'm not. But vlogging is probably more dangerous. I'm just loving Dominator's hair today though. I kind of can't get over it. Woo! Okay. Slowing down so the stitchers can catch up. They're behind me. Now what's tricky about the Brooklyn Bridge? If you ever decide to come to New York and walk it, there's a bike lane and a pedestrian lane. We're walking from Brooklyn to Manhattan. So walking from Brooklyn to Manhattan is tricky because you have to stay on the right side of the pedestrian lane, which is right next to the bike lane. And there's so many people who walk over from Manhattan that they take up the whole pedestrian lane. So you're stuck in this weird middle place. So I told my, I told my knitters they should be careful when they hook or stitch or knit on the bridge because they, the bikes will, the bikes will run you over. And it's going to be very crowded today because it's a beautiful June day in New York City. So, good luck to us. Watch out for the bikes. Okay, so you can see, here's a bike coming through. And this is the walking. So we gotta cross over. Watch out for the bikes. Watch out. Watch out. Okay, we gotta cross over. Time. It's time to cross. Okay, this is all the space we have right here. You guys are doing great so far. Michelle's braving it. She's crocheting and, and bridging. Erin's doing it. She's got a she's got a sassy little knitter's backpack going on there. So cute. On DPN? Oh my god. You just won. You just won. You're but you're knitting lace. No! Oh no, 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 careful! Oh my gosh. God, what if we had left him? Okay, anybody else is anybody else knitting while they walk? No, it's hard, isn't it? But it's fun, right? Alright, let's take a boomerang. better. My hair is still crazy, but I'm here. I made it to Bryant Park, which whenever Nitty City comes here in the summer to teach people to knit, which I think is every Tuesday or Thursday, they put this beautiful Nitty City scarf on the, um, I think this is Gertrude Stein. Yep. Gertrude Stein statue. And then people can gather here. And if you see behind me, there are people knitting all the way across this whole block. And I've done a little walk through, walk by, and there's so many people knitting, crocheting, doing all of the really fun things, and I'm just, I just wanna dive into everybody's projects and see what they're doing. I'm not even knitting. I'm just talking to people, and I forget that I'm dressed this way, but 
it kind of calls attention to itself. So next year I'll go back to just being Christy, but it was my third year anniversary of Christy last night, so I just felt like I wanted to be the dominator today. So I'm doing it. Look at Tinkerbell. And you do cosplay a lot. Yes. I am Sci-Fi L on Instagram, so that's Sci-Fi S I F I L L E. You have to think about it. <laughs> I have to think about it. I'm also on Twitter. <laughs> and do you always do crochet when you do cosplay? No. No. Yeah, because you so kind of thing for me, but um, I'm taking inspiration from other crochet artists. So I love and it. And I also wanted to do it especially for today because it's worldwide and <laughs> in public day. For me, it's crochet for everybody. Yes. Else. Okay, let me see these wings. <laughs> oh my gosh. You're so inventive. It's too talented, Lumina, who stitched me up because it takes a village. It takes a village! So, my crochet guild, can you get them in the yes, shop? Yes, where are they? This crochet guild! It takes a village! And you can get the sign. Yes, let's can. get that. Ooh. Yes! Look at your guild! You guys are so beautiful! Rowena, you did it. You changed the day. And Sam, she makes some great things too. I, look at what she's wearing. I'm obsessed. And your bracelets? Beautiful. She makes great stuff. Look at you. I love you guys. It's finished. That's Naomi. She was in charge. Do I have something on my head? Oh, it's for my crown. Isn't it beautiful? And everybody from Stitch Up Brooklyn contributed. Isn't it great? I really like how it turned out. I think it's fabulous. We've been doing worldwide knitting, stitching, public day all day today. It's time for a meal, it's time for a kit. Thank you, Knit Crate, for sponsoring this last event of Stitch Up Brooklyn. I can't believe it's almost over. We have been stitching hard for the past 24 hours. So let's go to the roof. Hey everybody, I'm home now, I'm in my office. I think I realized just a few minutes ago, I don't think I did an outro. So I just wanna thank you so much for being with me on my Stitch Up Brooklyn adventures. And if you would like to participate in a Stitch Up coming near you, I encourage you to head on over to stitchupbrooklyn.com or 144stitches.com or stitchandhustle.com. I'll put a link down below and you can get on the mailing list so you know if a Stitch Up event is coming to your area. And thank you so much for coming on this adventure with me. I'm one tired stitcher right here. One tired stitcher. Thank you.